Well, hi, my name's Kay. Um, I'm from New Zealand, and this is one of my very, very first attempts at a mini album. And this is my very first attempt at videoing this, so bear with me, and I, I hope this work, works out. Um, I decided to make this album, uh, Girlfriend and I Get Together and Scrap. I've only been scrapping for about two years. And I love the timepiece album as well as the timepiece papers. So I've also incorporated another chipboard album amongst the timepiece. So um, I'm hoping that this is all working and I'm getting this on camera. So um, first all my bit of ribbons and laces and bling on the top. Um, with absolutely adore this at one of the shows we went to. I found this lovely fob chain and I've got some dirt that I bought back from Italy and of course some other coins and my crown. So that's my, my main bling hanging piece. Uh, front cover I've put uh, Tim Holtz gears and um, clock hands on the main piece. So we'll flip that over. So first page I have um, just done some stamping and stamped and embossed with gold embossing powders on the front page. And I don't know if you can see, um, if I bring it up close maybe, um, inside the little hands I've used some gears that I got from um, on eBay and they're all just little clock pieces and, and gears from inside and a little tassel and bling so so that's my kind of first page um, I'll just undo this to open it I think this is either Graphic 45 or Tim Holtz clips that you can buy because um, I'm new at this I haven't I'm not up to date with all my names on on different things so bear with me flipping the first page over um, and there you have it underneath I've made room so you can put tags or or photo cards um, and I've just used some nice bling, some feathers and um, all sorts of, of lovely flowers. So turning over to the first page which flips up um, try and get this on camera is I've just made so that I can put a tag and a lot of my photos which I've made into postcards so um, just with stamping and some of the timepiece papers. So that's some of the cards. And that just slides in like so. Second page. Um, I went on to scrapbooking.com and found how you can fold all these different things to make several tags. So um, with this one, I've made a tag but I can do photos and on the other side photo cards that can slide and have photos on both sides and little bits of bling and I've made all my own little gem that slides in there and you can do pockets on the top here another pocket on the side for tags and more tags and pockets underneath here little we enjoy laughter on the other side making the slides here's a, a Tim Holtz card uh, tag and I've put some of the rub on clock and, and on the front here I did um, eyelets around the side as you would just to feed to get a, like a fob chain effect with a chain and hung some bling on the bottom. With the Tim Holtz letter holders, I've used these throughout um, so I can do seconds in time and moments in time spells out. Flipping up to the next page, um, this is one of the lovely big gears I got on eBay. I think it's um, steampunk. So if you go online, you can bid and get some of these lovely extra embellishments. So real ones out of real clocks. So with this, I made another, I embossed some clear plastics 
and um, I don't know if you can notice it on there, the embossing. Um, but it's come up lovely with the gears, the embossing gears. And then a tag. And also using some of those little gears up on the top there. And on the other side I've done photos. So that just slides them. And some more bling up there. Going over to the next page. Um, I've done a little wee, little wee thing here that can flip open. Photo on here, another tag inside. Um, I can use the photo on the other side of that. And some journaling on the front. Tags that can come down as well from this side. Just some different type of journaling. When I went for my trip and what day. And another tag in here with some more photos and some little bit of journaling where and what I did. So that just closes. And of course, this lovely bling that I, I had to put on because it's just everything about Italy is bling and ambers and golds and blacks. So um, hence all these lovely little bits. Next page flipping up. This I made as like a little purse pocket with uh, camera, bling, this just unhooks and it flips up and I've got a picture up here on the flat of a beautiful villa that I went through and inside tags and also some bits and pieces on, on my trip details and a beautiful tag with um, another photo. So it fits in there, slides down and that just does that on one of Tommy's embellishments. So that's just one of the pages to give you some closer up. As I say, this is the first for me, so um, we hope this works. Uh, this was a bit of a, a, pretty much an OTT. I'm a bit of an OTT person. So on here, this is um, one of the clocks I had. I had a plastic piece of clock, clock from some time ago, and it said, remember, this is your time. So hence, um, and a bit of red on these different pages. So I incorporated some red with the embellishments and flowers. And on this clock, it just turns over and I've got all my pictures of Rome on there. So um, here was that a little bit more up closer. And underneath I have managed to do, I had so many photos of my trip and I didn't know how to quite incorporate it all in this little mini album. So I made postcards up with um, off cuts of some of the timepiece papers as you can see. And so several, it's a way of getting several photos into an album. I stamp them and then on the other side you can put all your photos um, of your trip for your family or whatever you want to do on there. So hence that's the way I get, of getting all my photos um, to postcards. And so I made a, a clear little wee way of, of putting my clock in here and another little wee um, I cut out on my little cricket that I've just got machine and then made also a pocket on that page as well where I can put another couple of tags with another couple of photos. So that was just the clock that I cut out and there's the D for the seconds. And this was one of my, my first uh, tags that I did and I just adore it. A uh, little bit of embellish and there's the O from the second. Uh, clear stamped with uh, stays on with my column stamp. And then a photo on the other side of one of the gorgeous little villages that I stayed in. I'm going to 
Nick Page. Um, a lovely big tag I made with some embellishments and some little beading and coins. And then some more my postcards that just fit in a plastic folder and lots of other little wee cards that you plenty of room that you can tuck all sorts into this. It was one way of, of making so I can get all my bits and pieces and and everything all at once into it. So, uh, and then uh, pretty much my last page, I made one single tag um, which to me defines Italy with bling and music and um, laces and it's just, I love it, it's got all my hearts and my coins and uh, some of the, the lovely bling and amber glass, I bought some amber glass in Murano, uh, Murano glass, which uh, shaped as great big grapes, so hence this is why I've carried on with all my ambers. On the other side um, of the tag, I embossed it, um, I don't know if you can see there, I embossed it and then I put embossing gold powders over it and then um, heated it and it came out beautiful. And on my last page, um, this was just a way of doing a pocket so that I could have so many photos to put in. So all these photos and, and this paper is just, this paper of time piece is just amazing. And it defines Italy for me with all these shutters and, and arched doors. So um, it was a way I put another little wee pocket on the front here for a couple of little wee extra postcard photos that I did <laughs> and um, quite cute. You can fit lots more in here as well and as I say these are once again all my postcards that I did with all my leftover papers that I used from Timepiece and then on the other side of course got all photos um, throughout the whole of Italy, Tuscany, Rome, Amalfi Coast, Bellagio, Lake Maggiore, it was just, it was just my OE. Um, I had to wait until I was cut near 50 to have my OE, so this was it. So the back page, I have just done the beautiful timepiece paper of the arch door. Um, so I hope you've enjoyed that and I hope it hasn't been too long but as I say my first time, my first mini album and I hope you've enjoyed. Thank you very much.